Jeez. Other from the same family. The shooting ever. took place outside a family owned bodega in Washington Heights. And that is where CBS 2's Christina Fan joins us live after speaking with a witness inside. Christina. Well, Dick and Christine, this was supposed to be a joyous time for the family. The victim had just flown here from Egypt to celebrate the arrival and birth of a grandchild. Instead, his family is now planning his funeral. All of a sudden, I saw the people, they laying on the floor. Gamel Abelez is overcome with guilt, despite nearly getting shot himself. The manager of Chopped Cheese Deli was ending his shift you Tuesday know, evening. I don't when care when these uh, sand, sun men, and these tigers get clapped, because, you know, when it comes down to it, they always side with the sun men. No, the fuck hey, they do. No, they don't, dude. Wow, what? No, they don't. Yeah. Man. Uh, I happen to know personally. They're they getting don't. murdered by these some people on the regular. Yeah, you know, they, yeah, yeah but they still side with them, though. The only, the only Not really, man. I mean, they just don't have that big of a voice in society. Yeah. Obviously, these guys. They, they don't get, get loud about it. All the time, and any one of them will tell you that it's 100% it. I mean, sun men doing it to them. Well, yeah. Let's see what right. this guy. And they'll say it unabashedly, too. Yeah, they, they I, I will. I can vouch for that, man. They don't. Like said, uh, they not down nah. with the brown. If your daughter, if their daughters bring you home, man. Yeah, they ain't playing. Excommunicated. <laughs> yeah, I I used to date this Indian girl. She was like super hot, but you know couldn't take me home. Yeah, to the they they not they not with they not down with the brown man. Despite yeah. years, yeah. you gonna be a single mother on your own. The manager girl. of Chopped yeah. Cheese Deli was ending his shift Tuesday evening when bullets started flying. Striking the owner's father, who was standing outside. Yeah, damn, he was standing outside, just st standing out there on his cell phone. Oh, shit. They, they, have a, they actually have a video of it. You can see the guys, the actual target scattering. Ending his shift Tuesday evening when bullets started flying, striking the owner's father, who was standing outside. He had the phone, but the line from Egypt, so he's not working here. So he asked me for the for the Wi-Fi, so he could communicate. Surveillance video captured the tragedy that followed, as 66-year-old Rada Girgis walked out to the corner of Broadway and West 162nd Street to call his son. Shots rang out, and people started to run. We froze. Oh God! Look at these fucking son words the video before the victim was hit and fell to the ground i tell you the truth i'm from middle east we cannot let somebody like that so i wanna like i wanna hold them up something but but the police stopped me said stay away Girgis had just arrived in the city a few days prior to visit his son and pregnant daughter-in-law oh these on burritos too that's these are little... crazy yeah, he just came you, just a you, couple you mean you mean you mean some burritos he's been there for a couple of he been there for a couple of days. Yeah. Is it like they were Dominicans, Puerto Ricans? Yeah. But these, these now these I mean some of them are black, but I'm just saying like that one's an umbrella. This one, the ones in the red. Prior this one right here. To visit his son and pregnant like daughter-in-law as police continue searching for the gunman who mistakenly shot him from a gray Audi. Waves of customers flooded the business to offer their condolences. These are hardworking people. This doesn't, they don't deserve this. There was a point in my life where I used to be homeless and they used to offer me food for free. You know, it's amazing what they used to do for me. Abeles too is trying to work through the pain. He's a family man. We don't have a relationship, but, uh, but I think like I'm too close to him from the first beginning when I, I met him. And according to witnesses, there were several teenagers standing in front of the deli when the shooting happened. They believe one of those teenagers was the intended target. Live from Washington. Yeah, this is Washington Heights. I've, I've been to the projects in Washington Heights, man. Um, this is up north of Harlem, right? If I'm not mistaken, right? North and uh, west. Yeah, north of Harlem. Yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been there. Like well, when is that right there? Ninety-six. I was in the. I, I, I was staying. That, in that block, that block over there, that they're on right there, every mm -hmm. the, every six months, there's a shooting, and they, the the cops in the old days, they would bring over what they used to call the Bloomberg Towers. You ever see those towers that they would bring over? Mm -hmm. 
and they, I don't know whether the cops actually sitting inside the thing and they would raise the thing up and there would be no more shootings. But now all they do is they'll, they'll park the car there for a while. Ooh, so, all right, they're glad. Nothing, nothing's going to happen while the car is there. Car will drive away. Another shooting. Wow. Yeah. When is that right there, Gladderman? Is it a uh, Don Brito's? Well, it's the uh, Washington Heights, man. It's the uh, Dominicans. Yeah. So Don Brito's. Mm. Yeah. I'm yeah. old. That's uh, so, no, man. Um. Well, although the the shooting, I mean, I'm not even sure how local everybody is. I, I because it, what, the thing about Washington Heights is. You can get there from New Jersey, from Connecticut, from the Bronx in two seconds. Yeah, but so, we're, we're pretty territorial, though. But no, mean, but it's like a central location. In other words, like if you want to pick a good place to, to meet to fight, that's it, you know? Mm. Damn. Yeah, imagine how, imagine how heartbreaking that would be when his body gets returned to Egypt in a casket Dude, and his standing, family has to go pick it up. standing next to his pregnant right. daughter-in-law. Right. Oh really? I didn't see wow. her out there. Wow. He was standing next to her wow. when he got killed. Wow. And he just drops. And he just drops like a stone and every and like it's just it's, uh, these these people, god damn, they, they spread so much misery. That's you should have 